Good morning, guys. Do you know that in India there are one village belong Russians? <laughs> Did you know that? Yes, it's a Russian village called Arambol. Don't ask me how it's happened that so many Russians come in here every year and especially now after mobilization in Russia like thousands of beautiful Russian guys came here in Arambol and let's check it out how how it looks Arambol village here in Goa For example there are signs with uh, Russian letters it's called Pratichne smashine, which is mean they have a washing machine, you know, not not just a hand wash. Here is a typical houses. So here you can take bike for rent probably, but it's too expensive now. Do you know how much scooter for rent for now? It's like ten thousand rupees per month. Before it was five or four, and now it's ten thousand because so many people are coming. Okay, here you can change money, and also there are sign like "Admien Valuty," which is a money exchange for Russian rubles, right? There are many Russians here. Yeah, yeah. Do you like Russians? Yeah. <laughs> okay, great. <laughs> Huh? Why? Why do you like Russians? <laughs> okay, there are guest house where you can stay a couple days before you find your own place to so stay. For example, here we stayed two nights, a month in, and my friends looks like Indian style already, <laughs> like two weeks in Goa, and here's the bakery. Um, yeah, okay, Russian ladies and coffee, one of the best restaurants, Meridian, <laughs> so this is the Russian girl, family, entire family, also, still there are some locals of course, hello, <laughs> do you know what means sugaring? Sugaring. It's a procedure which girls do like with hair, you know, <laughs> to be very clean. <laughs> it's Hello, can I ask you something? <laughs> there are many Russians here in Arambol? Yeah. Do you like Russians? Yeah. Why? Russia? Yeah, Russia. No, so, here you can see also some signs. This is in Russian, aesthetic dance. He's also a Russian guy who father is from Panama actually. Again, sugaring. This is about astrology, tattoo, yeah. Uh, it's uh, dreadlocks here in Arambol, so you see there are many services for Russians. And let's check it out in the restaurant. Let's place for breakfast. It's a um, most famous supermarket here in Arambol. And now we're going to drink some coffee in a cafe called Mama Momo. <laughs> yeah. What are these nice people? In yellow Vespa. <laughs> we came to drink some coffee. I thought they're also Russian, but they're not. You're not Russian? No. Who you are then? <laughs> Dutch. Dutch. You what? You're allowed to leave the country. You're allowed to leave country? Yeah, Holland. You can come here without any. You guys, like, you guys have mobilization at the moment, right? <laughs> we are not. Girls uh, still not in mobilization. No, no, no. <laughs> 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 
Yeah, uh, yeah, we still Russian guys also can leave the country. Actually, still, it's just not not for everyone. So, <laughs> because mobilization, because the war. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it's. I don't think it should be filmed if you're from Russia. Right now in our uh, it's okay because I don't live in Russia like three years or more, and I don't care. So we can say whatever we want. So how do you feel here in Aramboy? Like, do you feel too many Russians here, or you also have your own community? We don't really have a community actually. It's amazing. You see a lot of Russian people running around the place. That's it. Okay. Okay. They are okay? Yeah. They behave well? <laughs> yeah, so far so good. We went out yesterday, but not too many drunk guys. So. <laughs> not many drunk? No. Oh. Actually good. Yeah, because it's small, that's why. Yeah. It makes them easy and chill as well, right? Yeah. <laughs> okay, thank you so much. <laughs> why you choose Goa? What, what did you know about Goa? Uh, I traveled around India, ah, okay. flying out from Mumbai, we came from the south, the goal was in between. <laughs> I just had to go through it. Yeah. Why are no uh, Quite some people along the, the way up north said that Arambol was quite nice and chill. So compared to the south, the south is even more chill, went to Palalem first. Um, was also not too much happening over there. There's not too many people. It's like they have a lot of beach bars and restaurants. They're empty. So I thought it would be good to like look for some more people in the mall. Let's check out prices for the coffee. Here it's espresso 80, latte 120. Also, you can eat some toast. Yeah. Well, look, guys, it's a hummus toast. Let's try it. Mm -hmm. My friend just telling me the story how she met. Ты русский? А почему на тебе американская майка? А потому что я люблю Америку. <laughs> can, can you say it in English? Hello, are you Russian? Uh, hello, I am Russian. I like America. God bless America. <laughs> and God with us. Uh, so why you came to Goa then? Uh, why the situation? Because my government wants to call me to war. <laughs> are you funny? Do you, 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 under, you understand you will be in YouTube? Are you uh, not, not scared? Why not? <laughs> okay, why do you like Goa? Uh, good question. I like many different things. Uh, I like local beer. I like uh, uh, bike, uh, bike yeah. uh, moving, uh, Royal Enfield, Indian style, mm -hmm. good kitchen, good people, cheap price, uh, perfect ocean. <laughs> but I don't know why it's named Arabian Sea. I think it's cool Indian Ocean. Yes, exactly. Yeah, yeah. So Me different too. things. And by this situation, uh, that's on the way to be. I think it's not only way to be right now. There are other countries like Kazakhstan, Kyrgyzstan. I was there. I was there. <laughs> what will where, I do? Where you started? Uh, Kazakhstan? Belarus. Belarus, oh. Kazakhstan, Emirates, uh, mm. India, and it's not end way. Yeah. yeah, me too. I'm a girl, but still, I flew to Bishkek first, then to Almaty, then to Abu Dhabi, and then to Goa. So the but same. it wasn't problem for you to travel. Yes, uh, this. I'm. I'm just traveling. So, but yeah. Uh, <laughs> because I understand that why well, guys do it. <laughs> yeah, and girls, girls the same. Just escaping our government. It's it. So. And what do you think about uh, countries where it was? I really like Kyrgyzstan. This is my favorite. And India, it's not that easy for girls because you know there are many Indian guys who stare at you. This is the uh, problem. Yeah. But you, but same, you same. didn't been in Baga. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Baga. I've been last time in Baga. No, uh, Baga. It's horrible. But, but for free cocktails for you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Senia, where are you going? We're going home or? Uh, yeah, to go home and then I think I'll go beach. Okay. The weekend today. See you. See My you. channel Peace. called Tanya Bez Granit and My, Telegram. Ah, uh, yes. People told me about you. <laughs> really? <laughs> yes, yes. You are a neighbor of uh, Kate. Kate yeah. and Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I should visit them too. I say hello from you. <laughs> oh, okay. So. Yeah. Peace. <laughs> Ciao. Ciao. Oh, YouTube работает! <laughs>
He said before telling him about me. But it's about my Rus Russian channel because the English channel is just 100 subscribers. So please subscribe and put like and I will record more video in English if you want. Ты мне, кстати, перекинула? Ага. So, here we in the, at the beach and this place called Sydney X. There are many Indian people here, but their neighbors are also a Russian place and it's called Chica Palace. There you can pay in rupees or in rubles. Can you imagine? You see the sign rubles or rupees. So, and this beach looks much better during the sunset actually. But now you also can see some beauty. <laughs> so yeah, this is our beach where I go every day. Yes, there are also many families here. <laughs> you see, kids and husbands. And I really like this boat. It's only shadow you can get for free here. <laughs> Russian girl, I think. Are you Russian? Nope. Yeah, that's a huge surprise. No? <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is. Where are you from then? From Poland. Oh, okay. What's you, you are. Yeah, no, 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 it's not the same thing, we cannot say No, that. of course not, I wanted to say, you are so beautiful, so, uh, yeah, okay, say hello, <laughs> thank you. Мы в Мексике познакомились с девчонками в первый или второй день в какой-то кафешке сидели. Мы тоже признали их в русских, а они оказались польками, не помнишь? Я. это... Yeah. It feels like, you know, <laughs> it, it feels a little bit awkward because I wanted to say, oh, like it's all the same. I want to say you as beautiful as uh, all Slavic girls or as all uh, Russian girls. But yeah, it's not polite at all. And I know it. It's funny. Oh my God. Now I feel <laughs> ashamed <laughs> a little bit here. Okay, we came to La Vie in Rose. Uh, this is the entrance. We go into yoga retreat. Let's see what's going on there. So, what is going on here? Что здесь такое? А это кино? Репетиция. Oh, all right. So, oh, so many guys. Damn guys. All right. I think they are filming. Let's go to the rooftop. Yeah. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. <laughs> so many beautiful people. Oh my God. My God. Okay, we came. So, ah. <laughs> so today we have Sylvia. Yeah. She's our shaman. And today is day three of the Magical Life Academy, Magical La Vie Academy Festival. This is the Accelerator Center of Excellence Blast Off Festival. And this morning, Sylvia is going to offer a shamanic circle. And she will be offering shamanic circles here every Monday and every, is it Friday and Sunday? just weird feeling when here we have a shamanic practices there they have shooting while killing and dying and here my girls they have biggest transformation singing songs and there is just a shooting process so it's a strange but it's how Goa actually is this is a real Goa you know
это очень сильно. Очень. Okay. Прям пронизывает. Какой вы актер крутой. Я вообще актер. Следите за эфиром. Супер, все. Вас берут или сколько человек было там на кастинге? Здесь сто должно быть человек. Сто человек возьмут одного? Три дня идет кастинг. Снимать зимой. Январь, может быть, декабре, в феврале. Это солдат английский. Какая-то войнушка. Я не знаю. 173 сантиметра. Я весил 67 килограмм. Call me. Как-то можно, можно снять, да? да. А, где найти мужчину в Индии? Просто приди на, на кастинг, они там говорят все. Нет, не говорят все. Рост, вес. Рост, вес, но они только не говорят, да, женаты они или нет. Well, it was my first, definitely first shamanic practice. And I'm happy I did it here in Goa. And with this people, because... You know what's most important? Mm, they never push you to do something or to try something. They softly guide you and do not push. Uh, try medicine or experience something if you don't want. So this is most important important for me. But I enjoyed meditation, songs, the energy. It was really nice, really. Uh, just one thing that surprised me, and it's always surprising, and. In this environment, when everyone so high level energy, you know, so progressive, there are sometimes people who can uh, scream on you a little bit or make uh, some notice to you. So, for example, today I was translating a little bit to my friend what is going on because she also first time here and her English not not that perfect to understand like the details and then one lady told us please shh, can't can you just like keep silent I can't concentrate and then she was just really bad energy you know and how can you be bad energy if you're doing this amazing practice hi my name is Casey where are you from uh, from California hmm? Hmm. Which city? Uh, outside of uh, Los Angeles area. Yeah, I've been there. I like yeah? it. Yeah, yeah it's very, California. very busy, very congested, but very interesting. Is that why you came to Goa? <laughs> well, I was raised in India, so I, I know India well. I spent over 20 years in India. Mm. Yeah. Where in India? Uh, in Uttar Pradesh, North India. Mm -hmm. I went to school in uh, Masuri, which is oh. outside of Dehradun. Rishikesh, that are doing. So you like all these practices? You participated? I've today? always been into this ever since I was. I could think I was always into alternative thinking, and you know, I grew up with gurus and sadhus and Ganges River and all kinds of crazy insanity. And here, do you feel it's deep enough here in Goa? Or? Well, it's it's. A little new agey, so it's a start. Uh, I mean, how deep? That just depends on the person. Mm -hmm. And of course, it's always what you get out of it, you know? Some people not so deep, but if you can pull it out of them, then it becomes deep, so... But yeah, it's a good starting place, I think. You, you came here to, for them, or it just happened No, I'm here? retired now. So you've been spending time in Goa and then... Goa, I travel around India, mm -hmm. go north, Tramkot, Pushkar, Rishikesh, Varanasi. But uh, yeah, I've been everywhere in India pretty much. And <coughs> how you joined this... Uh, uh, well, I, I know Kari or Silver and I know Ludmila and my neighbor is uh, Sylvia. Okay. <laughs> so, yeah, so this all very close, you know, people and 
this is their opening, you know, season now, so. You live in Arambol, all of them here, or in Serlim? No, they're all here. In they all Arambol. live here, yeah. yeah, yeah. For many years, all of them? Well, you know, everybody comes and goes. Mm. You know, they come six months, they go six months mm. like this. So, yeah, for many years, yeah. Mm. Ludmilla's been coming, I don't know, maybe 30 years? Mm. And Sylvia, I don't know, seven, eight, nine years. So, I've been coming many years too. I, I won't say how long. Great. <laughs> Will you back to United States soon? Never. Never? Why? Why, why go? <laughs> I don't work, it's expensive, it's boring, it's it's interesting, but I mean, there's nothing for me there. But you have your pension from the United States? Yes. You know, it was my very, very first time uh, that I've done anything shamanic, and I felt totally protected and nourished and guided and safe, that I could really let go. So, thank you for your divine essence that you shower us with. Thank you, thank you. I can't wait till Sunday. Well, uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't wait till Sunday to throw so, up. A big introduction to Kapo. Kapo is the shamanic medicine of the Amazon jungle. <laughs>